Here is my magic book. Every time I open it up, there's a new story inside. Let's see what today's story is. The Different Duckling Once upon a time, there was a duckling who was different from his brothers and sisters. They were yellow and fluffy. His feathers were gray. Soon all of the animals on the farm began to notice that he was different. His mother said, Do not worry what the other animals say. Look at the flowers. The little duckling looked at the flowers. The mother duck asked the little duckling, What color are the flowers? There is a yellow flower and a blue flower and a pink flower, said the little duckling. Yes, said the mother duck. They are different, but they are all beautiful. You are different, but you are beautiful too. The little duckling wanted to believe that, but all of the animals on the farm were so mean to him. One day the duckling met a cat sitting on the fence. Meow! What an ugly duckling! Meowed the cat. That made the duckling very sad. The little duckling met a fancy dog. The fancy dog barked, row, row, row. What a funny little ugly duckling! That made the duckling even sadder. The little duckling met a beautiful white bunny nibbling grasses. What a funny duckling! If I didn't know better, I would think your beak was a carrot, and I would nibble it. That made the little duckling very, very sad. The little duckling kept waddling until he was very tired. The little duckling decided to rest in the shade of a beautiful tree. He was lonely. He heard a little bird singing in the branches. The bird was beautiful. She was blue and she sang so sweetly. What kind of bird are you? Asked the little blue jay. I, I don't know, said the little duckling. I am different and everybody thinks I'm ugly. Go home, little duckling. It is wonderful to be different. You will see. That made the little duckling feel better. He remembered what his mother said to him about the flowers. They were all different, and they were all pretty, too. But the little duckling got lost on his way home. He was lost for such a long time that it became winter. The snow began to fall. The little duckling was sad, cold, and lonely. An old woman found the little duckling and brought him into her cottage. She kept him safe throughout the winter. She loved the little duckling. When spring came, she took him to the lake near her cottage so he could swim. It felt good to swim in the lake. The little duckling felt happy and strong. When he looked at his reflection, he saw a different duckling than the one he remembered. He was not sure what he was seeing. The old woman came to the lake. She smiled and said, oh, Why, you have grown into a graceful swan. He was grateful to the old woman, but he wanted to go visit his mother. The proud swan flew home to visit his mother. She was so happy to see her different duckling. She said to him, Now you are the most beautiful of all. You are a swan. I knew it all along. The end.